What is up guys, it is Tony here and today we're taking a look at the Polaroid Automatic 250 LAN camera. This is one of the iconic Polaroids. Uh, it is a compact camera from the 1960s and was extremely popular during its time. The way this camera works is it actually um, has an accordion style. You can probably see uh, the accordion style folded up above the lens part. But now you can see it fully extended. You'll see also there is a plastic uh, little lever that I am pulling down now, which is how you pull the shutter to prepare it, and then you push down the button to release the shutter. It's a very primitive early design for compact cameras, and of course it's a Polaroid, so uh, this is going to be your instant printing type of camera that you can use. And you can pretty much use... Uh, most Polaroid film packs with this camera no problem. So as you can see now I am going ahead and showing you guys where you would put your film on this camera. You simply switch this lever on the bottom and boom it opens up your shutter area and to the left you can see where you put your film pack. It's a very simple easy to use design and it is very interesting for the time. Speaking of interesting one of the most interesting parts of this whole uh, camera in my opinion is the viewfinder the viewfinder up top of course also where the flash is located you can see the viewfinder on the right this is of course a range finder uh, viewfinder setup where basically you have a separate lens from the lens the camera produces an image from and as you can see on that logo on the top left this is a Zeiss glass viewfinder which is very interesting to me uh, but all in all, this camera is extremely uh, cool, especially since it has the old 1960s uh, way of focusing, which is pretty much two little uh, push, push and pull mechanisms that allow you to move forward the lens itself. This is a very iconic, interesting old camera, and I am very excited to add this to my collection. If you guys enjoyed this video of me overviewing this camera, go ahead and comment below and like, and subscribe for more in the future, and I'll see you guys next time.